Diagnosing your 48 is one task that you need to master. Now we will look at a very basic diagnostic command, actually two diagnostic commands that will help you to troubleshoot an issue. So let's start. All right, so the use case is that we're trying to SSH port one and we are not succeeding. So let's uh, start with the Diag Sniffer Packets. Let's just sniff the packets and Diag Sniffer Packet any. And let's use filtering. Let's use a destination host for 192.168.1.1. And let's use TCP port 22 since we're using SSH and verbosity 4. So let's move to our terminal and let's SSH, SSH admin at 192.168.1.88. And nothing happens, so let's move back to our 40 gate and we can see that a scene is being sent, but we're not seeing anything beyond that. So that actually doesn't tell us a lot. So the next thing to do is to use the Diag Debug Flow, which can tell us much more details on the reason of that situation. So let's use Diag Debug Flow. Let's just enable it and Diag Debug um flow filter and the filter will be destination port 22 and let's just tag debug enable and let's see what happens let's just try to ssh again and we're getting a lot of information but the one that you need to look for is a message and that message is IP rope in check. IP rope in check is one of those errors that has several possible uh, um, reasons. One of them is that the packet is indeed destined to a specific interface, probably the management interface, but the service is not enabled. So the next thing that we can do is just to move to our interface. Let's edit it. And yep, we can see that SSH is not enabled. So let's just enable that and let's move back to our terminal. And there we have it. We have an SSH connection all set.